the nature of the CX bond. The CX bond in the alkyl halides is polar in nature. We can see here this, the, the carbon which is having the halogen is sp3 hybridized and due to this reason that this bond between this, the carbon and the halogen is polar in nature. This covalent bond, the polar covalent bond, the, uh, the polarity of this bond depends upon what? The electronegativity of the halogen which is there. That is why what we find is the CF, CCL, CBR and CI. When we see all these four CX bonds, what we find is that the dapple moment of these uh, the, for the, uh, the CF or the CLR is approximately same, whereas it decreases with the increase in the atomic number of the halogen. The reason is because as the electronegativity of the halogen decreases, also simultaneously what is happening is due to the increase in the size, the size of the halogens, the bond length is increasing. That is why the dipole movement decreases. But yes, this polarity of the CX is mainly responsible for its number of what we can say the chemical properties. Like they easily develop dipole-dipole interactions, so their bonding points are found to be much more than the corresponding hydrocarbons. Moreover, they can easily show the nucleophilic substitution reactions. A nucleophile can attack on this carbon because of the electron deficiency or polar CX bond. And as a result, what we find is that these uh, nucleophilic substitution reactions are found to be the characteristic reactions of these alkyl halides. The same is true for the aryl halides also, but what is more important to note in this case is that aryl halides are comparatively less polar, less polar than alkyl halides. The reason is this carbon is sp2 hybridized, more is the S character we know, higher is the electronegativity of the atom. So this carbon in comparison to this sp3 hybridized carbon is more electronegative. That is why the CX bond in the aryl halide is less polar. It is less polar. That is why what we find is, moreover, the halogen shows uh, the plus R effect, the plus resonance effect. As a result, what we find is that the CX bond is partial double bond. And that is why we don't find usually the nucleophilic substitution reaction shown by these compounds, aryl halides. So that is the nature of the CX bond is.